Traders within the Kampala central business community have come out to distance themselves from the plotted protests against the coming presidential swearing-in ceremony. Traders who fall under the Kampala Akeda's Advocacy Forum, CAFO, led by their coordinator Mpaji Sulaiman, confirms how the recent riots during the presidential campaigns were violent, ending up some lives of people with most businesses affected during that time. Something they are distancing themselves from and asking fellow business people not to participate in any intended protest during this time. Our business at the we are greatly concerned that the planned protests of crusaders against the swearing-in ceremony for president may destroy our lives and businesses. So we distance ourselves from such acts and plans and advise our followers not not Allow anybody to persuade you to be part of the protest. Paji also cautioned politicians against planning such protests that will destroy their businesses, and him, together with other business people, called upon all politicians with such minds to reconsider their plans if they are to be held. We are not going to allow any politicians to come in our businesses to destroy our businesses and properties. In this regard, of different parties, political parties especially, to reconsider their plans if they were trying to plan anything which can cause death and loss of properties, they should reconsider it before they act. For other means of settling, and they, they should look for other means of settling their political issues other than opting to destroy our businesses and lives. Traders claim that their businesses have not yet picked up following the COVID-19 lockdown and therefore asking government to reconsider giving them a stimulus package to avoid the collapse of their businesses. Business, we are brought, we are, about, we are hit by COVID-19 pandemic and the political rights during campaigns. We ask the president and all concerned government agencies to also consider the collapsing businesses. For, for that matter, therefore, we request for financial business recovery instead of buying tear gas and other security. However, on the new taxes that have just been passed by Parliament that include a tax on data, rental taxes, among others, the traders say these taxes are going to affect them greatly, forcing some businesses out following the COVID-19 pandemic. About the taxes, the new taxes, the amendment in taxes, the business committee is going to be hit after the COVID-19 pandemic problems after the campaign, political campaigns which we are preparing for the, the last months, the, how, can, how come the, the, the planners of the country, the planners of the government, at the very time they, they come out with new tariffs, new taxes, and the increase, the increase in taxes, the business community is going to be affected more. So we appeal to the president to reconsider the increment and the introduction of new taxes. For this period, we need recovery. Not our taxes. You cannot tax people who are not who cannot afford to pay those taxes. Brian Senkumba, Channel 44 Prime News.